morning. Well, I left Canada and I've headed to uh, Australia. Right now we're in Victoria, Australia, in the south coast, a little town called uh, Lorne. We're on the Great Ocean Road. I was up at sunrise, recorded one message, but uh, it was really dark. I don't know how well it came. Just a beautiful, beautiful area. So, we've got some pictures this morning. I'll show you the rest of it as we go on. Ah, sunrise now. Not much color. But uh, going amongst all the rocks here and trying to get a composition. I think uh, the tide's going out. I'm not sure. I tried to get a hold of the tide, tide tables last night on the internet, but it was down. So, but I got a fairly good escape route out of here if I have to. But uh, it's nice being by the ocean. The ocean is one of the things I love the most. I just never get enough of it. The smell, the sound, the waves crashing. Are a lot different than uh, landlocked Alberta, anyway. Yeah. So, anyway, I'm going to go walk around, take some photos, and if I find a good composition, we'll set up and we'll take a shot. Okay. Talk to you later. Okay. We've got a bit of color in the sky now. So, I'm set up, got this fun uh, composition here, and I'll sort of walk you through it. Let's see. Okay, so what we're uh, looking at here is uh, we have this little chute here, the waves are coming in. I have the rocks and the leading lines out. They're on a the, uh, bit of a diagonal, starting from the corner here. And I have it on, uh, let's see, a 160 or F4. About one-sixth of a shutter. Yeah, I just want to go over my uh, setup. I have a polarizer filter that's screw-in type. Then I've screwed the adapter ring for my Lee uh, filter system onto it. And then I put my leaf filter system on and then my uh, 0.6 ND soft grad because I don't have a hard grad. One of these days I want to get a, probably my next purchase would be uh, the Lee uh, polarizing filter that goes on the front of the whole setup. But this works for the meantime so I'm very happy with it. And that's it. So basically give you a shot of it and yeah, that's the way it looks. And I'm just okay, uh, I got another composition here. <clears throat> I think this is the last one I'm going to show you. I'll just turn around here. And uh, there it is there. I have this tidal pool in front of me. So I got that leading and I have some clouds breaking or Sunlight breaking through the crowds there, so I'm going to quickly try to grab this one, and then I'll explain my setup to you. So, okay, we're on one third of a second, F9, ISO 100. I have a .06 uh, graduated, ND graduated filter, and my polarizer. Sun's coming through, we're going to take a shot. Ah, perfect. What a highlight blowing out in the uh, the sunbeams there, but not too bad. So that's great. It's just uh, I'm having a great time being here by the ocean. It's, I just love it when I get near the ocean. It's a fantastic place to be. Yeah, for a uh, boy from landlocked Alberta, it's nice. Anyway, uh, it's about oh, a good half hour after sunrise, I guess now. So I'm going to wander around a bit. Uh, this will be the last time I'll talk to you, but if I get any more uh, pictures, there's a pier over here, and I'll walk up and see if I can get in there. 
I'll be sure to post them at the end. So you guys have a good day and see you soon. Okay, well, we're gonna call it a morning. Got some nice shots. Make sure I put them on the video. So, and we'll probably be in touch with you soon. Okay, you guys have a good day.